Hey guys, what is going on? It's Mason Sassball here and welcome to another Koji Black Ops 3 video for you guys right here on my channel. Today we're going to be talking about something very, very interesting indeed and this is the fact that five new weapons for Black Ops 3 multiplayer have been revealed. Now when I say revealed, I actually mean leaked. So there was an update that went out yesterday for both Xbox One and also PlayStation 4 and within that they accidentally leaked a way of experimenting with some of the new weapons which are going to be added into the game at a future point. Now, as of now, it's unclear exactly how these weapons are going to be added into the game whether they'll be part of um, a future map pack or if they're going to be part of the supply drop rotation but I'd say at this point is most likely going to be part of the supply drop rotation. We also don't know when they're going to be officially revealing this. It'll probably be coming out probably sometime later this week I'd assume because all this stuff got leaked but uh, I do actually have some gameplay clips for you guys right here of all of these exclusive new weapons. So I just want to give a huge shout out to Hopsicle for recording these for me. He's absolutely amazing. He got up really early and uh, I don't know why, but he just managed to make all these videos for me. So that's really, really great. Uh, but we've got five different weapons here to take a look at. Uh, and I've got to say, these weapons look ridiculously powerful. So we've got weapons called the M2 Raider, the Marshall 16, the NX Phantom, the Fury Song, and also the Iron Gym. So the M2 Raider here is a brand new assault rifle this is essentially the same as the mk14 assault rifle so it's a single shots assault rifle you guys are going to see some footage right here as he picks up the gun uh it's also the, this gun has been used in previous cod games it's been used in ghost it's also been used in world at war and you can see it absolutely destroys them and i think it's about two shots to kill them so it's a really powerful single shot weapon single shot weapons typically are quite powerful to use uh you know you will know that from the shiva assault rifle which is obviously also very powerful we've got a few clips here of him just uh killing some bots here there's only um if available offline at the moment if you want to access this. If you do want to get access to these weapons you simply have to disconnect the internet from your console and then launch it and go onto a local game and against bots and some of the bots should have these weapons and you can just pick them up off the floor off their dead bodies and that's how you gain access to them. But you guys can see the M2 Raider here it looks absolutely insane you can just go ah oh, like honestly the weapon is just so powerful and that's not the only one the rest of them are also extremely powerful as well. Uh, so the second one we have a look at here is called the Marshall 16. Now uh, this is actually a little revolver. What happens? Sorry, a little revolver. What happens is it has two shots within the barrel, and uh, it will shoot them both at the same time. And if both of those two shots hit a player, they will kill them in one shot, essentially. So as you guys can see here, he shoots them and it kills them in one shot. Absolutely insane! It just kills so ridiculously fast. A lot of these weapons really are extremely powerful. And as of now, I'm honestly quite worried to see them in the full game um it just looks really really insane to use obviously you do have to reload after each shot has been taken with the um the uh the marshall 16 but it is a one shot kill if you can hit him so close range this gun is going to be absolutely insane it's an insane revolver and it, it just looks really really good uh the next thing we have a look at here is actually the nx phantom now this is a sort of crossbow we haven't seen a crossbow in black ops 3 before so this is possibly going to be the replacement of the crossbow from previous Treyarch games uh but this is a lot more powerful as you guys are going to see here as he picks it up it looks absolutely insane, and this is yet again a one-shot kill on enemies. Obviously, it's going to be quite difficult to aim with from long distance. It does have an iron sight so you can look down, but uh, if you're trying to do it without looking down the scope, then it's going to be relatively difficult to do. But <laughs> I say that as he just shoots him across the map. But these, remember guys, these are, this is against bots, but at the same time, it is also going to be extremely powerful because it kills him one shot like pretty much from any distance. I mean, just look. You, you can just kill like three people in a row like that. So it definitely looks very, very powerful. This is going to be one of these special weapons so it will take place of your primary weapon so uh you know if you do want to use this it's going to take place of your primary weapon it doesn't have a huge amount of ammo but obviously it will allow you to get lots of kills with just one shot if you can actually aim it so it's absolutely insane i don't think you can actually pick up the cross bolts off the floor after you've shot them but um it still you know just does a load of damage and it's just absolutely insane uh the next thing here is a melee weapon this is called the fury's song and this is going to freak you guys out this is actually actually a sword you can use within the game so as you guys can see here he runs around with this giant sword it looks absolutely insane it's not essentially extremely effective I mean it's about as effective as using a knife in the game so you know you don't really get a huge amount of range and also you do have to wait a while after hitting once before you can hit again but it just looks really really cool to look at I mean just look at it it looks like something you'd have out of zombies you can also of course flip it around doing the cool little animations you have when you press the reload button which is obviously really really cool and then the final thing we have here is also a melee weapon this is called the iron gym now this is actually going to be a crowbar essentially 
and uh, this is probably actually better than the sword because it allows you to hit much faster it doesn't look as cool but it allows you to hit much faster as you can see you can just keep hitting again and again and again uh, and you know it just has a standard sort of um, crowbar look to it you know it's not really much to say about it other than that but uh, yeah this is all the five leaked weapons guys within multiplayer which will be coming relatively soon I don't know when whether this will be something that will be happening you know this week or something I mean I assume if they've added it into the game this early on then it probably means they're planning on releasing it sometime soon so i assume it'll probably be getting added into the supply drop rotation you know in like the next few days or something or maybe the next week or so uh, but we'll just have to see how that works out i'll be sure to update you guys if anything does happen with that but for now thank you so much for watching i really hope you have enjoyed huge shout out to hop school again for giving me this gameplay but thanks so much for watching i hope you guys have enjoyed and i'll catch you all later